the African Union Commission, together with the FAO and Agripreneurship Alliance, we had undertaken a study just to understand the agricultural incubation scope um, of the continent, the ecosystem scope of the continent. And based on the outcome of that study, where we had identified quite a number of challenges that the incubators were facing. So we had presented the outcome of the study to our ministers, and they agreed that there was a need for our government to be more engaged and to be more supportive of agribusiness incubation ecosystems on our continent. And they had also mandated the commission with support from other partners, such as the FAO, to begin to come up with some kind of pilot projects in a few countries, and then we can phase that up and we can scale it out. So we had brought together um, participants from the incubation networks, from Uganda, and the key players as well, and the government, represented by some of the ministries here, and also from Malawi, from Zambia, from Zimbabwe, and also from Kenya. And over the last four days, we have had a lot of discussions where we had identified several key components which would inform the development of that project. Components ranging from the mentoring to capacity building, to setting up um, collaborative networks, to looking at issues of policy and also funding. And one of the key takeaways uh, for me from this uh, workshop has been that the challenges are the same. And so what we just need right now is a cohesive support from our governments, particularly in terms of the policies, for them to provide that enabling environment for our incubators to supporting their incubation networks and to ensuring that they give them the necessary support that they need because we also see the incubation networks as very key drivers in addressing the issues of jobs for our youth and issues of wealth creation for our youth. So this has been a very, very successful workshop and particularly because by October of next year, we need to begin to respond to our ministers how far we have gone in terms of implementing the decision that they had taken for us to support agricultural incubation networks on our continent.